CBS has announced it's tweaking its debate plans to include more foreign policy related questions in light of the terrorist attacks in Paris the night before. With that in mind, it's important to know what each of the three candidates' previous foreign policy positions have been, specifically in the Middle East. First up is Hillary Clinton. She has perhaps the most hawkish outlook of the three, mainly because she supports a no-fly zone in Syria, something that would need to be backed up by some U.S. military muscle to be done effectively. Bernie Sanders, on the other hand, is firmly against a no-fly zone. And what I believe, Chuck, very much is that the most powerful military on Earth, the United States of America, that our government should do everything that we can to resolve international conflict in a way that does not require war. Martin O'Malley has come out on Sanders' side, advocating against a no-fly zone as well. I believe that a no-fly zone right now is uh, uh, it's not advisable. As for ISIS, all three candidates agree that ISIS must go, and that a coalition of nations, not the U.S. on its own, is the best way to do that. For Newsy, I'm Jake Godin.